How are you doing? Uh, TJ and Biscuit here with a uh, special little review. Um, I get to check out, I think I'm the first one to review this. Um, my mate Chris, uh, Phoenix Chili. And this is one of his sauces, he's got three coming out. Now take a note, notice of the name on uh, the label, this was a test label. It's not what uh, is inside the bottle. Um, I believe that this is called Bombay Mix. Um, um, and he's also got one called the Italian Job and I think he's done a Mexican one. It will come in a box of three. Um, but this is his sort of Indian curry um, spice blend. You all right? How you doing fella? Third ball day for him. Um, so we've, let's have a look at the ingredients first before I haven't got the original label on, so I'll have my fingers, look. I've got it all over my phone now. The bottle's uh, leaking a bit, he's, he's already tried it, so uh, the bottle is not sealed. Right, okay, it's got salt, uh, onion, garlic, cumin, ginger, olive oil, coriander, cinnamon, turmeric, tomato, pepper, fenugreek, garam masala, mineral water, smoked paprika, black cardamom, bay leaves, lemon juice, naga chilli and ghost chilli. Wow, that's a list. So this is really, really down the uh, Indian spice route, this is. Okay, um, let's give this a go. Yes, we did promise you some, a couple of videos on Thursday. Uh, we've been working out in this heat all week. And Chris and I, we got a bit of sunstroke Thursday. All bets were off. We, uh, we felt a bit lousy Thursday evening, and uh, all day yesterday in this heat, it's been terrible. So it didn't happen. We didn't want to give you, uh, you know, videos with a call. You know, you want to see us having a bit of a banter and fun and this, that, and the other. It feels thick. This in the bottle. It's hardly moving. Wow. Very thick sauce. Now I wanted to try this on the mother of pearl sperm, but I don't I think it'll go everywhere. Wow, that is thick. Chris, you made a thick sauce here, boy. It's all pouring out the top. I'm gonna have to try and knock that down a bit. It's going everywhere. Well, this ain't going according to plan, is it? It's just gonna go everywhere. All over your fingers. Oh, blimey. I am near, was there an air bubble in there or something? This is going to have to go on the plastic spoon. Well, the messiest hot sauce review yet. Courtesy of Phoenix Chili. I can smell those uh, Indian spices big time. Very, very depthy. Wow. I can't pick anything individual out because there's so much spice going on. But yeah, it's got, you know, you've got your usual suspects of cumin and uh, coriander and um, there's sweetness to it as well. Um, you know, turmeric, all of those cats are going on in it, but it's right up my street. So let's try and give you a, a little view of the pour. Um, I won't do it on the mother of pearl because it is so damn thick. Wow, 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 wow. You see, the can see it's actually coming out in lumps as it goes. <laughs> so look, you know, there's a full spoonful. Goodness there. Let's come back a bit. Don't fall over. Off the spoon. A little bit less off the spoon with uh, all the smells and that. Some aromats going on in there. There is a sweetness, and uh, I don't remember reading vinegar. I know that this sauce is uh, vegan, um, and uh, the uh, mineral water. I've, I've not seen many sauces with mineral water in there. Anyway, Danny actually put this a go. I'm literally chewing it. Very, very heavy on the spice. 
did say to Chris I'd give him an honest review on this. I'm not going to be biased just because he's my best mate, but it's almost a sauce that you chew. The last sauce I had that was this thick was um, the first uh, hot hot one sauce. Um, the last that Redux. I want to get more of a. I wish I brought out more than one um, tissue uh, kitchen. Oh, but I do want to try that again off the marble pearl spoon. This is where you see it go everywhere because it's quite a little spoon. I'm liking this so far. I really am liking this. It was so thick, it was almost like um, it had potato in it. Right, let's try and get this on this little spoon. This is where you see it go everywhere. Right, now we're going to get the true flavour of this. Nice clean flavour off the mother of pearl and the ash. I'm gonna enjoy this. There's a lot of freshness to it, really fresh, and that's what Chris wanted. He wanted you to have a taste, you know, and have, have the um, texture there, um, you know, the onions, tomatoes. Um, again, I mean, I can't, I can't really pinpoint anything else out um, other than the spicing. It's just how I would make a curry, to be honest with you. Really nice. Just for you, Chris. And I'm going to have another go. Um, I'm not going to give it a flavour rating because we're all different. And I don't want you to, because uh, this will be available on Chris's. Uh, Phoenix Chili website. Um, have a full spoke there, guys. And uh, I don't want people to think, and he doesn't I want people to uh, think I'm giving a, you know, trying to help out me mate. I want you to. Uh, Go down and find out yourself really on, on the flavour. I mean, this, eat this, let's get this around the right way. It's delicious. Now, I've tried a lot of hot sauces over the last five or six years from all around the world. This is one of my favourite sauces. I'm not just saying it, it's come up with a real cracker. If there was any criticism, it might be a little bit too thick you might need to put add a bit more mineral water in there um, but you know if you want to taste the real flavors um, of the ingredients that have gone into a sauce that's one for you I'm telling you that is really good and if you love Indian food you're gonna like that um, heat level um, for me it's got a nice background heat a little bit on the tip of the tongue in the back of the throat he hasn't gone mad with it and he doesn't need to he could do a hotter version of it um, just by adding more peppers or a hotter pepper um, which he may do later on um, no extracts we don't like extracts we, we've had enough of all that um, just tanks your sauce just ruins it to be honest with you so that was our uh, little review mate got to try not to uh, I've curry sauce all over you. Or curry, yeah, you can smell it, don't you? You can smell that, can you? you smell it? Yeah, and that's on the other end. I've got it all over this end. Can you smell that end? I bet you don't like it. A bit, ooh. Well, you do like it. We might have a potential little curry head here in the animal world. So, Phoenix Chili's uh, Bombay mix, um, part of a trio of sauces i think he's going to do them in a box set and i'm sure he's going to sell these uh, singly as well and uh, that is a damn damn good sauce um, messy one to get out of the bottle chris but um who cares who cares it's, it's a really good sauce and it's one of the better ones that i've tried um 
really impressed. Really, really impressed with the freshness of it all and the flavours. Um, you know, it kind of gets you straight away and and then it calms down and it's that it's like when you I eat a fresh pepper, it's that that aftertaste after all the madness has calmed down and you can taste the pepper. Um, you know, all, all, all the uh, because when, as soon as you put it in your mouth within seconds you can't taste it anymore, you're you're just on fire. Yeah, so this uh, yeah, this is great. Go great with Papa Dom's um, onion barges um, on the side of a plate with a I don't know, Bombay potato, something like that. You could even chuck the bottle into a wok and add chicken to it and you've got a curry. That's that. Okay, right. I've been TJ Burns. This has been Little Biscuit and um, if you like the videos you know what to do guys. Uh, uh, like, share, subscribe. Um, leave a comment for me um, in the comments area. Uh, click the notification bell if you want to be notified of uh, new videos. Click on that, I think you click on it and then there's a drop down menu here and it all, you press all and you will be notified uh, whenever I put a video up. Alright, um, I'll be seeing you a bit later on with another review. I'm going to do a couple of videos because we, 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 we kind of uh, didn't deliver in the week. Um, but I'm sure you can understand uh, we all know how hot it's been this week and it's not been easy working out here doing this polytunnel should hopefully be finished on Monday we've got a ton of sand coming to uh, do the floor and uh, we'll get the ground sheet down we control it up and seal it up then and it'll be a bit cooler next week as well so that, this will be finished I can start potting up while Chris builds my uh, tomato uh, and uh, bell pepper growing area is, is going to do another job for me before he goes on to uh, something else. Um, yeah, and I'll be uh, busy potting up. Alright, guys, we'll see you on the next video. TJ Burns Biscuit, signing out. Thank you.